Hello and welcome to Brave Souls Rewind. Byakuya week, the last one, where I'll be taking the different Byakuyas in the game, 200ing them, and then figuring out if any of their builds are still viable. But if you're watching this, you probably already knew that. In this video, I'll be reviewing New Year's Byakuya, and as always, I'll be starting with a normal tech damage build. After the last Byakuya, I was pretty scared of this build. It didn't really go that well for OG Byakuya, and since this is basically the same thing, I was afraid it wouldn't work out well. But I actually liked it okay. His attack is higher than OG Byakuya, and he's got a plus 20 bruiser. I will say it was still annoying getting closer to the enemy every time a normal attack was used, but at least they were dying a lot quicker. So I'm gonna say this is a viable build. But maybe not for co-op, just kinda single player. Next I tried the strong attack damage build, which is Byakuya's link, so I figured he'd do okay. And I was right, he did a pretty good amount of damage, and his normal attack was useful when waiting for his strong attacks to recharge. If I had one complaint about it though, it'd be his strong attack 1. Sure it's a ranged attack, but the hitbox is so narrow, so unless the enemy is directly in front of you, you are likely to miss. It's still a good build though, but again, maybe pick your battles for this one too. And finally we had the strong attack recharge build, and I wasn't really a fan of this build. The only boost Byakuya has to the strong attacks is his own link, and while they do recharge faster, they don't do that much damage. So at that point you're stuck with normal attacks that don't do that much damage, and strong attacks that don't do that much damage, and you're kinda stuck dancing around the enemy until you can kill them. So I'm gonna say this is not a viable build. So I contemplated giving this Byakuya bonus points, because his special was so cool looking, and then I thought, nah, that wouldn't be very professional. But then I thought, screw it, it's my show, so we're doing it. But even with that, it doesn't take Byakuya to a high grade, because while he is usable, he should really only stick to single player. 